Hello, this is Victor at RestoreMercedes.com and this video is uh, a pump a test for Yuri in New Jersey. Okay, now this pump has some issues. This is a door locking pump from a 94 uh, S600 coupe and because it's a coupe then I just cut out some circuits and uh, door locking and unlocking and the trunk handle and rear parktronics those little guide antenna guides those are the ones i left i shut down loom bars i shut down vacuum because it is what it is it has problem on the vacuum and it's it was in pretty bad condition so but it doesn't matter i mean uh, what we needed to do it will do now first thing is uh, right now i do want to show you that <clears throat> in reality our pressure circuit works and it works quite well so just real quick it's trying to pump as you can see it did pump up the bottle pretty well and it's holding it's holding very nice the only problem is I think you have a leak in the seat somewhere so it's going to continue reactivating the pump and that leak and it's going to burn the pump out so i want to shut the circuit down i just wanted to show that it works if need be it could be reactivated there are no leaks in the pump itself and that's what's important here so next thing we're going to do is central locking central unlocking so for that i have this vacuum gauge here so you can actually see activation of locking and unlocking let me just try i can't see and make the video see that was point over point 0.5 of a vacuum and that's like point 0.6 point 0.6 in pressure don't mind the gauge it's a little bit inaccurate inaccurate a little bit but as you can see door locking and unlocking work fine no questions there the next thing is uh, what have we here we have um those little parktronics antennas how to show you that i need to to have ignition on all right well anyway so f let's do the handle next the handle this one that's the trunk handle in the trunk that comes in and out when you open and close the trunk so let's see trunk handle pressure 0.6 that's when handle comes out vacuum 0.7 is when handle is being retracted back you can see right here vacuum pressure so that works fine the only thing is i have an issue with i want to show you those little rear headrests uh, not headrests this this car has electric headrests so we only have just this is european car by the way it's a fully german car imported from germany with headlight adjustment and everything how can i show you this let me think negative positive positive 220 mm. so i need to show these two all right i'll try to do it this way i'll take like something like this whatever See, that's connected to different port. And then there is a little delay. And it's supposed to activate to go back in. <clears throat> that's it. So I didn't touch anything. So when you back up. And those little antennas are extended. They don't go down right away. Because maybe you're parking. So, see, I disconnected everything and we wait 
and here's my my other hand so we we'll wait and you're gonna see that these things will reactivate to pull them that was the pool so when you're parking and if you go from park to drive drive to park park to drive all the time so antennas will go up down up down so for that there's built-in timer in the pump so they continue uh, they stay up and then they go down and so forth so on okay so this is it the pump is done i'm shutting down this loom bars you can see it works but i don't want it to i don't want it to be active just in case okay so this is going to be all this is victorystorymercedes.com i have another pump to do actually so and answer the doorbell all right thank you for watching